today's video, everything will be fine. I'm sure this will be a really easy video. Afterlife, no problem. Everything will go smoothly. Everything will be great. I'm looking forward to it. I hope you are too. Hopefully there's nothing in the title that says otherwise, but we'll see, I guess. We'll see. Make sure to subscribe for more Afterlife videos as there's definitely going to be more to come. I'm pretty sure right now, at least, there probably will be. Anyway, let's get started. <laughs> Hello, hello, and welcome back to Afterlife, where I am a treeborn or something like that. Is it a treeborn? Forestborn, that's the one. And as you can see, I'm floating up to the top of my tree. Oh, that rhymed. And we're actually going to start today's video with something different, as our main man, Solidarity Gaming, has invited us over for a fight. And you know me, I love a challenge. I love punching people. I've got to go. So. Apparently, we're not allowed to use any abilities or weapons or tools or anything like that. I'm, I'm not sure if we're not allowed armor, but I'll take it just in case. Maybe I can put a backpack in the chest, but let's go head over to his and let's go kill him because when am I ever going to pass up an opportunity to kill Jimmy? Oh, there's a lot of trees here. I wonder who did this. Where is this smelly, stupid, ugly, silly... Long for my match. Hello, oh, got... oh. you peasant. Are you here? Are I'm you here, here for the match to fight. You don't. You don't know who you're fighting. I'm yes, the I do. It's you, you idiot. Strongest, agilest, uh, man in the world. And in you the forgot server. stupidest on there. Do you want some carrots? No, you, no, no, I don't. I don't. I can't eat carrots, and that doesn't make me stupid. No, pick them back up. Oh, okay. Pick them back up. Right. I don't need them. Follow I've got me. So many. Follow me. Follow me. This is a chest for all of your stuff. No armor, Joel. No armor. No weapons, uh, Joel. No, no weapons. No moves. No spells, Joel. Okay. Jimmy. I don't know why you say my name so much. Is it meant to be intimidating? Because I don't find it intimidating. I find it quite it's pleasing. A... I actually quite like it. Say it more. Joel, it's going to be a <laughs> bare knuckle match. Bare knuckle. So I'm not even allowed to use yeah. this. Oh, I've accidentally floated, Jimmy. No, no, come I didn't back mean down. to do that. Come back down. I'm, I'm How long the does arrow. it take? Uh, it's uh, going away in a second. I'm coming back down now. It's great you, ability. Wait, do you take any fall damage? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> right, if you just stand on this side over here. I don't okay. think you know what you got yourself into. Yes, I'm I sorry do. for about what's cracked. To, what, at I, PvP. I, I don't care I'm if sorry. I probably have a heart disadvantage, which is my excuse if I do lose, by the way. Uh, but yeah, I will win. I've got many lives. Right, oh. are you ready? As soon as I hit this gong, we can beat each other up. Okay, crits only. Right, you ready? Yes. Three, two, one. Let's I'm, go, let's go. I'm reloading my fist like Henry Cavill in Mission Impossible. No. <laughs> I saw that the other day, actually. It looked really cool. <laughs> no, that's Top Gun. You're thinking of. Are you no, doing any no. damage to me? Am I doing any damage I'm to you? I yes. Wait, what? How many hearts you want? Out. Okay. I'm on, I'm on four and a half. You're on four and a half hearts? Yes! Wait, Don't <laughs> what are you, you are on? Useless. I'm on three and a half. Wait, I'm on why? Two. Don't bite Oh, two as well. No! I'm I on, missed. I'm on one and a half. What? I'm on one. Ah! I'm on two. Oh, no! Oh, of all the deaths, this is the most embarrassing. This is the one I, I hate the most. I can't believe I've just lost to Jimmy, of all people. It's just embarrassing. It's the start of the episode, but I just want to end it here. Two lives left. You can finally see what my skin looked like. Radical dude. But you know what's not radical? Me anymore, because I'm dead. And I'm now a Gravital. What the heck is a Gravital? You use gravitational... F oh, Jimmy's died. Oh, that's awkward. I need to go get my stuff from his. Push and pull forces around the battlefield. Polarizing allows you to send enemies flying away from you or towards you, depending on your polarity. Send out an invisible blast of gravity to send you flying either forward or backwards, depending on your polarity. Gravity power, you have multiple increased stats due to your gravity control. Interesting. You weigh less overall, so some of your stats have changed. Right. You botched a blast and ended up flinging yourself right into a desert. Don't get that. You are magnetic by nature, so you have a problem with wearable iron items. Uh-oh. Hopefully I can wear diamonds still. Gravity, you are constantly pressed on by gravity, making you vulnerable to attacks. What does that mean? That I'm pretty quick. Look at me go. And I can jump high. And I'm out of food. So all these powers. Hmm. Seems kind of out of this world. Almost like an alien. Oh, wow. Wow. Ooh. It's me, smallish beans from another planet. Ooh, ah, ooh, ah. 
Okay, that's enough of that. I now have big eyes and different colored skin. Um, do I look like an alien? I'm still kind of wearing Shrek's clothes, so probably not. But where do aliens live? Well, of course, another planet. But how do you get to the other planet? Spaceships! I'm going to build something that's quite literally out of this world. Also, I've not really tested out my power yet. What does this do? Oh, it... Wait, what? Sends out an invisible blast of gravity to send you flying you forwards or backwards. Oh. Right, it's just a little jump. Okay. it's bas I'm basically still a rabbit. And I can bring stuff to me. So if I attack like this eel here with a bow. Whoa. Where'd it go? Anyway, I want to build myself a flying saucer just to add to my land up here. So I'm going to need some blocks. I need some of these. I need some of this. And I also need some other stuff from the end. So let's head there. May as well get some XP as well for teleporting around. I can't take fall damage, so this is nice. I love being able to do this. Woohoo! Why is there just like a load of random... It looks like someone has someone thrown their stuff. It is... What? Let's just pop that there and forget about it. Oh, gosh. What have I just done? Oh! What a save. I thought I'd speed stuff up with the ender pearl. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Oops. That was a close... Oh, my gosh. I look mad. Now, like I said, there is something else I would like. Oh my gosh, wait, this thing is so weird. Like, sometimes it sends you backwards, sometimes it sends you forward. Oh wait, is it? Oh, it's depending what I have pressed for G, I see. Anyway, I want some of these crystals that Lizzie's built out of here. I don't know where you find them. Has Lizzie got any in here? Is this where she keeps her stuff? What the heck? This stuff here looks kind of alien-y and gooey, doesn't it? It's also quite annoying, I just can't stop bouncing on it. So let's just collect a load of it. I'm not sure if it's all the same block. Oh, it is, weird. That should be plenty. I also need some of this stuff here. <gasps> oh my gosh, I can't. No, I've got everything on me! I can't believe it! Okay, guys. Uh, welcome back. I I'm on my last life. And I am now a robot. Well, half robot. Beep boop. Solid metal comes through your blood to become electricity. Right. I can shoot a laser. Hang on. That's pretty cool. Can I hit that duck all the way over there? Nope. Come here, eel. Yeah, look at that. I just destroyed it. Oh my gosh. Wow, it's quite powerful. Does it look cool when I do it as well? Kind of. You're not vulnerable to many detrimental potion effects, right? Due to your steel skin, you have five more hearts of health. Nice. You can break natural stone much faster. Ooh. And your iron skin strengthens you but slows you down. Oh. You're a robot, so you don't need any oxygen. You won't get exhausted or hungry at all. What? B no regen. You will not regenerate any health until you get a regeneration effect, which I can do with R. I can't go in the nether, basically. And lava and fire damage does a lot. But look, I can just heal myself. Oh, the skin. It's so wrong. It's so wrong. Now, those of you who've been watching a while, or everyone's series, may know that some people's deaths are planned. I can tell you right now, that was not planned, as I did have a uh, spaceship I wanted to build. I designed one. So I'm going to build it anyway, although I've lost all my materials. I'm so sad. I took everything that I needed with me. All my tools as well. Oh, gosh. All right. Let's get some XP and head back to my base. That duck did four hearts of damage to me. Holy moly. Oh, my gosh. All right, let's not die. Right, I've got my stuff. My regen's down. I thought I was going to be powerful, but, like, that just absolutely wrecked me. So, so I need to be careful because I can't, like, eat anything. Why does my own laser hurt me? I don't understand. Is if it hits something near me? Like, what? Or is it just... What? Does it hurt to use it each time? No, sometimes it doesn't. I don't understand. It's just if things are close to me. Weird. All right, let's make some armor. I hope I can wear armor. I can. Good. And embarrassingly, there's stuff I was trying to collect. Turns out I've got a load of it in a backpack somewhere here. Oh, good. I didn't need to go collect all that. So that's a bit silly. But I do need some other stuff now that I've died. So <sighs> this is a mess. This is all a mess. Got this for a weapon and that's it. All right. I know I keep dying in the end, but we're going back there again. Okay. It's just you can't get the stuff I need anywhere else. Oh, I realize I'm still an alien. Oops. Wally, I'm coming for you. Yes, that's right. It's me. 
Java, Eva, Java, J Beans, uh, Beaver. No, not Beaver. Fortunately, I have to wear this helmet for my protection, so it looks stupid. Luckily, there was some of this weird blue umbrella membrane stuff at spawn, so I've taken that instead and we're going home. Lovely. Why have I uh, spawned back on top of this tree here? Ow, cool. S sweet. Thank you. Let's just gather up the rest of the materials. I need some glass, which is like sand. My skin's gonna be nice and white, but because I'm a robot, it's been greyed out. I hate it. Ah, the good old cactus farm. I miss you. Not really. I don't miss this area at all. You ugly. You ain't got no alibi. U G L Y. Whatever. I'm just gonna stop now. I'm like ever so slightly slowed, and it's very slow to get around. I miss flying. Remember when I could fly? I'm not talking about tree barn floating. Oh, for goodness sake, just took damage. I'm talking about when I was a dragon. All right, we've got ourselves some green grass. Glass. We just need two stacks of these. And honestly, I think we pretty much got everything we need. Apart from maybe some like dirt for building. It's not a super complicated build, but it's effective. It's a spaceship. So here I am on a tower as we are about to start building. I guess it's time for one of those things where I speed up the gameplay. What are they called again? Time lapse? No, that's a whole different thing. Time lapse, that's it. Is that an alien song? Well, I don't know what that is, but it just came to mind when I was uh, building this thing. But look, it's an alien spaceship, and whoa, what's that? It's picking some stuff up. It has just come to my realization that I, I was singing the Doctor Who theme. It's not really space, is it? It's like time travel, which is kind of space, but not really space, is it? No, so that's kind of embarrassing. It sounded cool though. No, it didn't. I can't even say that. So I guess the whole thing was pointless. I could just go back and re-record that bit, but you know what? No. I think you deserve to hear it. But yes, here is our spaceship. Look, it's picking up carrots. Whoa. What? Why? Why is it picking up my carrots? It's actually not picking up anything right now. I'm going to place some like bits of dirt around like it's picking them up. I would do carrots as well, but I can't actually make carrots float, unfortunately. There we go. That looks pretty good, doesn't it? And then we can sort of like, you know, like dig out. Oh, oh no. Place. Uh, oh no, wait, no, guys, guys, I'm just ahead, hot, I'm not hot, I'm not alive, oh my gosh, I'd made profits, I forgot to check, I thought I double dirted that entire thing, I must not have, oh my gosh, I was trying to place like a dirt block down, but I didn't have any water on me. It was only one block deep, but I was tr I should have dug that out, really. Tr trust me to fall in lava when lava damages me the most. Oh, well, where there it is. That's afterlife, guys. It's done. This is my final area here. A lot better looking than my other one. I'm happy with it. The spaceship, not finished because I forgot to dig out the blooming hole. But I guess that's always like an area that'll be remembered as the place I died. I don't know what to say. Thank you for watching this series. Um, all 10 lives are gone. Some of them quite stupidly, some of them on purpose. That one, again, wasn't on purpose. We died to Jimmy. That one definitely wasn't on purpose. Um, but yeah, th there we go. Goodbye.